Section 35P, which provides for the jailing of journalists for five years or in certain circumstances ten, is a very significant misjudgment and overreach. I don't regard any of the politicians involved as being maliciously motivated, certainly not Kate and Kelly or Tony Abbott or Bill Shorten, but I'm heartened that Anthony Albanese thinks this was an overreach. Two aspects of the law are very, very bad. One is that you can never report on a special intelligence operation, even if it's uh, uh, long since gone. And, and the second is the, all of the internal processes are, are not subject to outside scrutiny. I think that's bad for democracy and it's the kind of thing that r eventually leads to security being delegitimised and all the conspiracy theories uh, gaining traction. Uh, Greg, why do you think uh, these laws or proposed new laws haven't received the scrutiny you think they deserve? Well, I think both the government and the opposition are at fault here. It's a very bad law and we're in a, a, a silly, dumbed-down stage of politics where everything is either double plus or double minus. So the Labor Party opposes everything the government does except national security, where it supports everything the government does. I think that's stupid. I was a bit slow to get onto this law myself, but it's... It's a very bad law because it gives the government the power to declare that you can't write about something forever. That's a wicked and excessive power, and I hope the politicians revisit it.